know what I was just remembering? What? That song. You know the one. My mother's song? Aye. The beehive and holly bush growing side by side. Tell of my love beating steady as the tide. Walk, walk away, away, fair lass, walk, walk away with me. To the hills filled with wild blooming roses. <laughs> <laughs> we got here. Looks like she dug her way in. Spying on us, are you, wench? You're a bit far away from your pillows and perfumes. I'm traveling. He kicked you out. <laughs> the old monster kicked you out. <laughs> <laughs> I need a horse and cart. You won't find anything like that here. Not anymore. You people like to trade, don't you? I propose a deal. What? I need your help to get to Ben Moorhead. There's a ship coming, and I want to be on it. I have all sorts of information. Things you'd be better off knowing. Now you're a spy for us. It's a simple bargain. I know that Longinus wants you to run. Tell something useful. How many men does he have? He left with 20 troopers. What's to stop you going back to Longinus when he's more to your liking? Or the other way around? I... I don't think that's going to happen. You're out to make mischief, aren't you, wench? I say we put her where we can keep an eye on her. I say she leaves. Hmm? <laughs> you will regret this day. I already regret it. She's all alone. Aye. So are we. Even if we bury them, you know Longinus will dig them up. At least we will have done it. is in trouble she could die she your sorcerer could save her this is a dream right? no dream if he really is 400 years old he should be able to translate something that could save her life but why would he possibly do that i thought he loved you well that's open to debate but even if he did why would he help you in case you've forgotten you are the bane of his existence Diana, you asked me to help you once. You were afraid and sought my protection. Now, I swear, if you help me now, Longinus will never hurt you again. 
just to be that you. Don't you understand? I like it. Money hurts me. I'll keep that in mind. Father! Be still here. <clears throat> Queen Diana has news. I don't care to hear it. I think you'll want to hear this. Longinus is coming to kill you. I came here to help you. Your help I could do without. I am not the enemy. All right. Longinus has gone mad. He's turned against everyone. When you destroyed the Spear of Destiny, you took away his chance to die, and for that he's sworn to punish you. Your husband murdered my family. Your people would murder my land. The sorcerer is going to... He's gonna... going to kill you tonight. Since when do you care about my welfare? If you die, who do you think your followers will blame? Oh. Me. Yeah. Rome. It's always the Romans. We have done some good, you know. Tell that to your god. I want you to live, Connor. I think we can work together to make this land a better place for both of us. We can start by paving these roads. You don't belong here. Neither does your monster. The curse he has is the curse he deserves. Now, we have two choices. Cut out your heart. What? <laughs> we'll teach you to ride. <laughs> You're killing yourself. Let your beast come. If he wants to die that badly, we'll find a way to accommodate him. I don't suppose you fellows would like to guard the doors tonight. I'm getting married, you know. Take your precious gold. Die with it. That's all. 